we recently stepped out to engage young people on the right to privacy to pretty much understand if they appreciate this right to privacy, if they understand it, and this is what they are to say. Privacy is securing my, my information from the public. Kwekubane information owa ebi kwata konga bi gobi esigali zanga gomundu. This is when uh, you keep something to yourself and don't share it with someone. Personal, yeah. Everything about you that you want to keep to yourself. In my own terms, it's like uh, holding something for yourself or you don't want to share. Your own personal space or something like that. Privacy is like secrecy. Someone is on personal details that are not exposed to the rest of the other companions. According to me, privacy is uh, like information, personal information that uh, is secret and you're not supposed to open it to someone else. Well, that's what they had to say. But what is privacy and what is the right to privacy? Privacy is essentially your personal space. And the right to privacy is that power to determine who comes into that personal space. In the advent of internet, many young people have acquired phones. They are using social media, they have social media accounts, and in exchange, they are sharing their personal information. For someone to come into your personal space, they ought to know one or two things about you. That could be your name, it could be your phone number, it could be your location, or your image. So how do you protect your personal space is by protecting your personal information. So the right to privacy means you determine who acquires your personal information so you know who comes into your personal space and to what extent do they come into that personal space. As unwanted witness, we realize that many of these young people have shared their personal data in the name of acquiring social media accounts, acquiring SIM cards, getting into uh, academic institutions. And this information, if not used responsibly, could lead into the infringement of the right to privacy. Remember we said the right to privacy is that personal space and the power to control who comes into that personal space. As unwanted witness, we decided to respond with the campaign Beramu. Beramu essentially is a cautionary statement that cautions whoever collects data, personal data of a data subject, and specifically that of a young person, to be cautious and responsible in using that personal data. So essentially, what we are doing with Beramu is we are empowering youngsters to know their rights, to, to, to understand the obligations of those who collect that data. That should you collect that personal data in exchange for a service or in exchange for a social media account, then you ought to be accountable. If you must collect this data, you ought to protect it. We urge data collectors to be responsible with whatever data they collect. Be transparent and be accountable. So to the telecom companies that register these youngsters and collect their personal data, better move, be responsible. To the health service providers, better move. To the insurance service providers, better move. The e-commerce sector, especially those that have transport services or deliver services to these youngsters, better move. To any other data collector who collects the personal information of these young people in exchange for a product or a service, better move. Be responsible and accountable for the information you collect. And to the informal data collectors, for instance your friends or relatives to these youngsters, be responsible with the information you collect about these youngsters. My privacy, my right.